Yeah, it's clear that we have to focus on the match that we have uh, tomorrow against against France, but we uh, we wanted this morning to not lose the opportunity to see the video and to analyze a little bit about the mistakes that we did yesterday. I think it's important. It's something that we missed uh, with the two matches that we didn't play in Germany. Uh, it was a pity because that means that we arrived to play this tournament just with uh, this important match against Croatia, just with the match against against Ukraine. And I think that the team showed again that in defense the, the team was really strong, but we had many, many problems, especially on transitions and uh, positional attack. We were not good, we made uh, too many uh, misunderstood. I will say uh, something that with, I'm sure that with more time of time, more time to work with the team and with some more matches, this will be fixed. But of course, after that, in, from now, uh, we already prepared some uh, analysis for, uh, for France and from this afternoon we will try to fix some small details to play against them uh, tomorrow and to, try, uh, and to try to do like in Zerenjanin uh, one year ago and to win by three, that it means that we will go to the, to the main round. Even that uh, was good because they scored only 23 goals, uh, there are some mistakes that we did, that we can recover some more goals, but it's clear that our main problem was the transition, it was like an existing transition, just uh, Laza in some moments he took the, the initiative, but uh, as, a, as a collective uh, transition was not good. And the same in the positional attack. Uh, I don't want to speak about the roster, about the problems with the COVID and like this, but it's clear that for some players this is the first major tournament and uh, the ambience was really hot and uh, this is the way we need to improve, we need to work, we need to keep working with the plan that we have and uh, it's a pity because we miss one really good opportunity to be in the main round and to get more experience, more matches it means more experience and uh, we must to try uh, tomorrow at 100% with all, with all our hearts and especially with all our head, uh, really with cold heart, head to, to be sure that we are doing on the way that we have to do it. Is the physical part is so important for some players like Dragan, like uh, Marsa, like Kukic that they play a lot yesterday and uh, they will need to, we will try to recover them but the, the psychological part is the most important one but we cannot forget that the conditions that we play against them one year is completely different conditions that we are playing now after us they make a really good uh, world championship and they won the medal on the olympics and this team from france they are playing with huge confidence they showed against croatia the first day they were leading all the match yesterday they make a good match against ukraine and we arrive we will say to this match after our first defeat and without the possibility that we had last year to prepare the match against France with full squad and with all-time training. Full squad it means that even that some players were not there, but from the beginning until the day of the match we had the same players and we, kept, and we could work. And now the problem is that every few days we are changing players and then those who are going out, some others are coming, but they don't have time training with the group. But uh, this is the situation that we have now, then for this the situation is completely different, but I'm sure that the guys, the team will, will fight at 100.